Hey, good morning, everybody. Hope you're all doing well and uh, being safe and trying to stay busy. It's hard, isn't it? I understand. Um, we got to read aloud this morning. Froggy bakes a cake. It was Froggy's mother's birthday. Froggy was outside making mud pies. Froggy! called his father. What? Help me make a cake for your mother. Oh, please, cried Froggy. I want to do it all by myself. So Froggy flopped into the kitchen. Flop, flop, flop. You will need flour, said his father, and sugar and chocolate. I know, cried Froggy, as he pushed his chair up against the counter and climbed up. Sorry, no fun. There we go. He took down the flour, he took down the sugar, he took down all the chocolatey candy his mother had hidden since Halloween. We need flour and sugar, said Froggy. And he dumped a large bag of flour and a whole box of sugar into a big yellow bowl. We need lots and lots of chocolate, said Froggy. And he dumped in the handfuls of ten chocolate flies. <laughs> Yuck. We need milk, too, said Froggy's father. I know, said Froggy. As he flopped to the fridge, flop, 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 and grabbed a carton of milk. Oops! It dropped on the floor and spilled. And eggs and butter added his father. I know, cried Froggy. He snatched a carton of eggs. Oops! He only broke four or five. And just one stick of butter fell on the floor. Don't forget the baking powder, said his father. I know, cried Froggy. And he climbed up and took down the baking powder. Then he cracked seven eggs into the bowl. Crack, 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 crack. And only a few shells fell in. And he put in the butter, blup. And poured in the milk, glub, glub, glub. And finally, he dumped the whole box of baking powder. Shloop. Time to mix it all together, cried his father. I know, said Froggy. And he stirred it and slopped it and mixed it and plopped it. Then he dumped all the goopy baked batter into the cake pan and shoved the cake into the oven. And he sang, Ookly bookly book burbly bake. I make and I will bake and I wait for the cake. It's hard to say this morning. Froggy! called his father. What? While you wait for the cake to bake, help me blow up the balloons. That was always always my job for my kid's birthday. I got to blow up the balloons. Froggy helped blow up the balloons. He blew, and he blew, and he blew, and he blew. Pop! Now, said his father, help me set the table. Froggy helped set the table. Oops, he knocked over the lemonade, and the paper party tablecloth got all wet. Froggy! called his mother. What? What smells so good? It's a surprise, yelled Froggy, and he flopped back to the kitchen. Flop, flop, flop. Come and get it, hollered Froggy. Froggy's mother and father flopped in and slid across the buttery floor, and Froggy said, Are you ready? And he opened the oven door. What do you think they're going to find? Yikes! The cake exploded, yelled Froggy's father. Oops, cried Froggy, looking more red in the face than green. Too much baking powder, I guess. It's good, though, it's good, though said his father, licking his fingers. Wait, cried Froggy. I'll be right back. Flop, flop, flop. Oh, I have the hiccups. 
Somebody, somebody scare me. <clears throat> Happy birthday, Mom, he said. And he handed her a fresh mud pie with a can of it in it. I made it all by myself. Oh, Froggy, said his mother, this is the best uh, birthday pie I've ever had. What a mess, said Froggy's father. Let's go out to celebrate. Great, said Froggy. Yes, said Froggy's mother. And together they leapfrogged all the way to the bakery. Flop, flop, flop. The... Well, I hope Froggy learned a lesson. You have to follow the directions. I'm going to get off here now since uh, I have the hiccups. And hopefully, um, I don't know, I don't explode. So, have a good day today. And I miss you and we'll see you later. Bye.